Hi, and welcome to Senior Shape and to your cardio, hit, and strength workout. Whole workout is in a seated position. Make sure that you have a chair that does not have any sides or arms on it. I'm using a pair of five pound dumbbells. That's a great weight for me. Always start lighter if you need to. You could go a few pounds heavier as well. We have four blocks to this workout. Each block has two cardio moves that we will repeat twice. And then we have one strength move as well. Then we go on to the next block with new moves. We'll get started with a warm up. Sitting up nice and tall. Inhale, arms come up. Exhale, arms down. Inhale. Exhale down one more time. Let's add a march here. Throughout this workout, make sure that you're in a tall seated position. And we're going to be sitting forward in our chair for most of the workout as well. Okay, hands down. I want you to do a knee up, knee up, knee up and hold. Knee up. Up, up, and hold. Using our core here. Up and hold. Knee up. Arms come up, then we do some high knees. So lift, lift. Bring the elbows down. And breathe. Four more like this. For two, arms to the side, knees to the sides. Sides of just turning the leg out from the hips. Lifting from those inner thighs. Two more. Back to the knee, straight up and down. For four, three, two, and one. One more time, out to the side. For four, three, two, and one. Big side reach all the way up. And put it down. Lift. One more time each side. Pull onto the sides of your chair or just hands down, and then step those legs out side to side. Let's add our side stretch. For four, three, two, and one feet directly out from those hips. Chin up, we're gonna roll it down, chest forward, hinging from the hips, and then drop that chin and roll it all the way back up. Let's do that again, chin up, roll it forward, drop the chin. Now come halfway up, little cat cow here. So chest forward, chin up, and then round the back, chin down, again. One more time. Articulating in that spine. And let's come all the way down one more time. And roll it up. Fingertips on those shoulders, some big shoulder rolls. Give me four, three, two, and one. Take it forward for four, three. Getting to our first cardio move, we're in a tap. Our legs out to the side. Add the arms. Again, it helps if you sit a little bit forward in your chair. Get a better and bigger leg extension. Just hold the one side now. Out and in. Four, three, two, switch it. For four, three, we go back to alternating. Here we go. Four more like this, then we're taking it to the back. So arms come up, and then try to get that toe underneath your chair. Anytime you're working too hard, drop the hands. This one's a little quick. Give me four, three, two, just the left leg. Four, three, two, switch it. For four, three, back to alternating. 
Get that toe back there. Four more. Then we start it from the top. Side steps. Here we go. Four, three, two, just the one side. Second and last time we do this one. Other side, out and in. Drop those shoulders, sit up nice and tall. Alternate, here we go, final eight. For four, three, toe taps to the back, here we go. Four, three, two, just the left. For four, three, two, just the right. Four, three, two, one more time. Let's alternate. Eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, and one. Nice job. Now for our first strength exercise. Sit up nice and tall in your chair. Again, towards the end. Palms up. Let's start actually palms in, bicep curl. So hammer curl, palms towards you. Four more like this. And two. And one, we're gonna hinge forward, bent elbow, and straighten it to the back. Little tricep kick back. Keep those shoulders down and low, pushed back. Elbows stay high. Two more. Let's put those two together. So we go bicep curl, tricep. Make it nice and smooth. Hinge slightly forward. Four, three, two. Last one, we've got another set back to the bicep curls. You can always drop the weight if you need to, or you can do every other hand or one side at a time, like that. Two more. Hinge it forward, triceps. We've got eight. Six. Elbows, elbows stay high. Two. Here comes our combo. Curl and up. Curl and up. Final four. Three. Two. And one. Lift. Nice work, put those weights down. And we're on to our second block, starting with the cardio. Let's take our arms up to the ceiling and we're gonna turn our legs out, lifting from that inner thigh. Tap and lift, tap and lift. Doesn't matter if you can't touch the ankle, just turn that knee out, lift the leg. All right, just the left, tap it. Just the right. For four, three, we go back to alternating here. Good, breathe. Final four, three, two, and one. Similar move, this time we're kicking the leg back. And again, maybe tap towards that toe or ankle. Try to get that foot behind the other leg. All right, now that you've got this, you know the pattern, single it out here. Seven, six, five, four, add a little lean. Other side, tap it. Three, two, and one, alternate, just eight. Then we go on to our next move. Excellent. Big side reach, big side reach. 
Let's add a toe tap. Hold it here, reach and pull. Other side. Four, three, two, and one. Back to alternating. Four more, then we go back to those knee turnouts with a tap. Tap and tap. Keep breathing. Four, three, two, just the single. Four, three, two, switch it, other side. For four, three, one more time, let's alternate. Good little twist in there, tighten that tummy. All right, to the back. Alternate, maybe touch that toe, or just try to get it underneath that chair. Hold it here. Four, three, two, other side. Four, three, let's alternate it. Last time doing this one. Side reach. Quick switch. Really extend that arm, extend that leg for four, three, two, hold it here. Singles, reach and pull. Other side, reach and pull. It's a quick switch, I know it. For four, three, two, one more time, let's alternate. Final four, three, two, and one. Nice job. Okay, grab your weights. Come to the edge of your chair. Plant your feet firmly in the ground and pull that belly butt into the spine, keeping a straight back. We're gonna come down and then push up. So just like we were doing a deadlift in a standing position. I want you to make sure that your core is pulled in so we don't use the lower back. Shoulders are down and back. Two more. Come halfway down again, and let's do some rows. Palms are still facing in. Bring those elbows up nice and high, using that upper back. Four more. Two. Let's put those together. So we go down, halfway up. Down and left. Belly button in. Push those feet through the floor. Neutral spine, so don't round the back. I know I'm giving you a lot of reminders. Last one is to breathe. We've got two more. Left and lower. Give them eight more here. Then we're done. We're on to the next cardio after this. Four, three, two, last one. Nice job, safely put those weights down. Okay, sit up nice and tall. Your guard comes up, make some fists, and we do some quick punches here, alternating. Eight more, six, four, just singles, a little bit slower. So punch it, bring it back. Punch. Four, three, two, other side. Eight. Sorry, four, two, and one, alternate. 
eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. Nice job. Same thing with the leg. So kick it forward. Kick it, kick it. Flex that foot. Give me four, three, two, just the left. Kick it, kick it. Four, three, two, just the right. And four, three, back to alternating. Here we go. Eight like this, then we're gonna add those arms. Four, three, two opposite arm is like, punch it. Eight more like this. Four, three, two, and one. Nice job, out and in. Step touch with the legs. Four, three, two, and one. Jumping jacks. One leg at a time. Stretch those legs out. Maybe come a little further forward. I'm gonna scooch forward in my seat there. Makes it easier. Four, three, two, and one. March it out here. Back to those punches. Here we go. Eight, six, four, three, two, one. Single. Little twist, tummy in. Four, three, two, other side. Or four, three, let's alternate again, quick. Eight, six, four, two, nice job. Back to our kicks. All right, just to the left. Guys are doing great. Just to the right. Three, two, alternate. Kick it out there, give it a little snap. You ready to add arms? Here we go. Punch, punch. Breathe. Four, three, two, and one. Side step. Little break here, catch your breath. Few more for four, three, two, and one. Jumping jacks. Get that leg out there. Four, three, two, and one. Nice job. Here we go again. Grabbing those weights for our next section. Palms are facing down. Sit up nice and tall. We're gonna lift them shoulder height, flip the wrists up, back down, and lower down. We lift. I know they feel heavy. We're not doing that many of these. And lift, flip, and down. Hold the weights, calf raises. So just lift those heels, push the toes into the floor. Use your own resistance here, really squeeze that calf muscle for four, then we're going to put those two together. Last two. Last one. Palms down. Here we go. Lift. As you flip, the heels come up and down. Lift. Makes us use our mind as well. One more. Excellent. Next set we're doing to the side. So same thing. Palms down. Flip. Release. No heels this time. Lift, flip, last one. Lift, flip, and if you want a little extra challenge, you can put those weights on top of your thighs. Lift again, lift. Squeeze those calf muscles, push, good. Almost there, for three, two, let's put those together. Up, flip with the calf raise and down. 
Just two more. You got this. Last one, left flip and down, weights down. We've got our last set of cardio. Make it your best, we're almost done. Hands are coming behind the head. You can lace those fingers if you want. Keep the elbows nice and wide. Tummy in, bringing our elbow to the knee. And left, crunch, left. Getting lots of nice core work in here. We've got four, three, two, and one. Hold it here, just extend the leg in down. Sitting up nice and tall, squeeze the top of that leg for four, three. Have you figured out what's coming yet? Let's put those two together. Knee, extend. Knee, down. Extend. Make sure to make it two separate moves. Extend. Knee. Extend. Keep those elbows back. You're doing great. And we're going to do our second cardio move before we move on to the other side. Nice job. Second cardio move. Come to the edge of your chair. Arms come up. And we're going to do a nice big swoop here. Think of like a figure eight or an infinity sign or you're going canoeing. Tuck that tummy. Tuck the hips a little bit as you roll back. Big sweeping move. It's as big as you can make them. A few more. Last one. Okay, arms are down or at the sides of your chair, and I want you to step and cross back with the other foot. So try to get underneath the other knee. Tap it back. Tap it back. Four, three, two, and one. Let's put those two together. So we swoop, swoop. Four, three, two, last one. Nice job, now we've got the other side. Here we go, elbow to knee. Four more like this, elbows wide for three, two, and one, lift the leg, lift, and tap, lift and tap. Try to straighten that knee. Squeeze the top, the muscle on top of that leg. Two, combo, here we go. Twist, open, extend, and down. Twist. I know you wanna slump in that chair. I know you wanna roll around your back. Fight it. Work that core, we're almost done. One more for good measure. Twist, extend, and down. Nice job, last set, swoops. Keep that tummy pulled in. And breathe. One more. All right. Cross it back. Try to make this as big as you can. Tap it back behind there. Four, three, two. Let's add the arms. You got it, stay with me. Four more. Four, three, two. And one beautiful job, last set of strength before we get to stretch and cool down. Okay, grabbing your weights. We're coming up to a nice high shoulder press. Elbows are at 90 degree angles. Let's press it up, come halfway back down. Up and up. For four, three, two, Hold them here, halfway down. Drop and lift the hands. Nothing else is moving except for those forearms. 
Hello shoulders, we've got four. Three. You ready for our combo? Here we go. We only do this set one time. So this is it. Drop and left. You can always do one arm at a time. Up halfway down. Drop four more. Breathe. Up halfway down. Last one, you got it. Drop and lift. Nice job, you guys. Put those weights down for the final time. Take a deep breath. Let's get ready for our stretches. Sitting up nice and tall in your chair. Big inhale, arms come up. Exhale down. Again, big inhale, arms up. Hold them up and then climb that ladder, reaching higher one hand than the other. For four, three, two, and one, release it down. Right hand comes out to the side. Gently pull it back, stretching out that chest. And then let's hug it all the way forward. Pull it in nice and close, either above or below that elbow joint, and push the shoulder down. Big inhale. And exhale. And then maybe drop your ear towards your shoulder. And let's release it down. Left arm comes out. Gently pull it back. And then we hug it forward. Inhale, drop that shoulder. And maybe ear towards the opposite shoulder. Inhale. Exhale, release. Stretch out both palms towards me. Flex those wrists, straighten the elbows, and fingers are pointed down towards the floor. Hold that there. And let's take it out to the side again. Open up that chest. Inhale. On your exhale, we flip our wrists to the back of the room, thumbs pointing down. And again, gently push back. Good, release it down. Left arm or your right arm goes up nice and high. Stretch it high first, then all the way over to the side. And back down again. Reach it up. Over to the side. Release it down. Both arms out to the side. And then tuck your hips, bring the arms in front of you, maybe lace them together, rounding your back. A little lean over to the side. And to the other side. Back to center, maybe flip those palms towards me. And again, round that back one more inch, really straighten those elbows. Release the hands on top of your thighs. Tuck the chin, we roll it up. Let's open up those legs a little bit, coming to the edge of your chair. Chin is up. We're going to drop that chest all the way down. Plant your feet firmly into the floor, dropping your chin. Tummy is in, and we roll it up nice and slow. Let's do that again. Chin up, hinging forward. You can't go any further. Then you drop the chin and round that back up. One more time. Chin up all the way down. Maybe one more inch deeper this time. Drop the chin. And roll it up. Let's toe heel in. Extend the right foot out. Coming to the edge of your seat. Toe to the ceiling, heel on the floor. Inhale, arms come up. Exhale, reach forward towards me. Again, trying to keep a flat back here. Reaching out towards over that toe. And then relax the hands on top of that thigh. And then maybe hinge forward, going ahead and rounding at the back. Go ahead and sit up nice and straight. Let's switch legs. Extend it out toward the ceiling. Inhale, arms up. Exhale, reach towards me. Out over those toes. A beautiful stretch all the way up the back of the leg. Release the hands to the thigh. Maybe round the back and go down a little bit further. Nice and slow, round that back all the way up. Bring the other leg back in. My favorite stretch, we'll go into a figure four, crossing the ankle on top of that knee. If you're unable to do that, go ahead and just cross at the ankle. 
Lift it up nice and tall, relaxing the hip. Inhale. Exhale, option to lean forward to deepen that stretch. You should feel that in the side of your hip. One more big inhale. Exhale, maybe go one inch deeper. And sit up nice and tall for me. Cross that leg all the way over. Arm comes up and then side twist all the way over. Big inhale and exhale. Come back to center and cross those legs. Same thing, either crossing at the ankle or on top of that thigh. Sitting up nice and tall, we inhale. Exhale, and the option to lean over here. Keep taking nice deep breaths to help those muscles relax. And come on up. Cross it all the way over. Arm comes up. And the other one, and we twist all the way over. You can use your arm to push against that thigh if that's comfortable for you for a little extra stretch. Come back to center and release it down. Hands down at the side. Give me some wrist circles here just to release any tension from our weights in our wrist and reverse. And let's finish sitting nice and tall. Drop the chin towards the chest, stretching the back of the neck. And slowly shake your head no, side to side. Finishing back to center and lift your chin. Roll those shoulders back. One more big inhale and exhale. Release it down. Beautiful work. I'm so proud of you. That was a tough seated workout, but you made it through. Burned a ton of calories. I appreciate you working out with me. Please give it a like, a thumbs up if you enjoyed the workout. Share it with a friend. Subscribe if you haven't already, and I'll see you at the next workout.